while you were probably celebrating your festive holiday, two prominent Ethiopian journalists were arrested in one week during the latest media crackdown in the East African country. Getashu Shifarau, editor-in-chief of Social Media News, Nigeria, Ethiopia, was arrested on December 25th and now is being interrogated for 28 more days. On December 19th, Fikadu Mekana, a news anchor for the state-run Oromio Radio and TV, was picked up from his home. Ethiopia, under the rule of the Ethiopian People's Revolutionary Democratic Front and the Prime Minister, has a long history of detaining journalists and activists for speaking out against the government. The Ethiopian government has been criticized by rights groups for suppressing freedom of speech, making unlawful arrests, and torturing political prisoners. Shifara and Mikrana were both reporting on the protest against the government's master plan to integrate the Oromia region with the capital, Addis Ababa. So far, up to 75 people, according to reports, have died as a result of police clashes with protesters. The two journalists have not been charged yet, but it's likely their alleged crimes will fall under the country's highly criticized anti-terrorism law, which has been used to brutalize and repress political opposition and dissent. According to the Committee to Protect Journalists, Ethiopia is one of the many countries in Africa with the most jailed journalists. At least 10 journalists were in custody as of December 1st of this year. You may remember the 2014 arrest of the Zone 9 bloggers whose unlawful detention caused a worldwide condemnation against the Ethiopian government. Six journalists and three bloggers were arrested and charged with terrorism and a conspiracy for their reporting. In October, the charges for five of those members were dropped, four still remain in jail. You just had your news update with the break. I'm Tracy Thompson. Thanks for watching.